Super and my Super Pair for Mario was that I recorded them at each episode at a time. And, uh, that was kind of slow. I'm not gonna lie. Oh my god, here's my favorite character in the game. Slithers, or Stanky, or Springy, I don't know his name. You think I should. You think as much as I play this game, you think I should know his name by now, but I don't. It's like I can't remember names for the life of me. So I'll just call you Snakey. How about that? I'll just, I'll just call this guy Snakey. Dude, I just love that music. Anyway, what was I talking about? Okay, well, what was I talking about is that the way I recorded my Super Paper Mario LP was one video at a time, but now I'm going to try something a little different. Yeah, it tells you to super jump here, but uh, you don't need to. Um. Okay. So what I'm going to try with the Donkey Kong Country 2 is I'm going to record it in like 30 minute intervals or maybe even in maybe even an hour interval. I don't know. I, I think I'll try for this time a 30 minute interval. But uh Let's see. Yeah, 30 minute might be good. Might be good. Oh, whatever. Jump over here. Jump over him, whatever. Oh, bonus game. So I'll be trying. I guess I'll record this episode in a 30 minute interval. So I'll have to split off my voice talking somewhere. Um, but yeah, I'll try that. And I'll just split the video. So basically, if I don't say, Alright, see you guys next time. And if the video kind of cuts off, then you, you, you'll you know why. Because I am not going to be, uh, recording one video at a time, because that, that just takes too long, I think. It, it took me a long time to do Super Paper Mario, and I think that this game will works out really well if you, uh, record it in sessions. Huh. <laughs> Cog. <laughs> Cog. Anyway. Yeah, so, uh, that's what I'm gonna be doing for this one. I guess I'll try it out with, um, I'll try it out with the 30 minute thing and see how that goes. But uh, anyway, we have a boss, our first boss now. Boy, that just kind of flew right on by. Caught Crow's Nest. Of course, Crow is spelled with a K, why not? Never went to grammar school, because he's a pirate. You know, a pirate parrot. Even though he's not a parrot, he, he's a he's a seagull. No, no, he's not. He's a, what is he? He's a, he's a hawk. That's, it says Crow, Crow's Nest. Oh my god, I could have got those. Dang it. You know, I'm gonna get those. I don't care if I got hurt. I got those. I'm not gonna die. Don't worry. Hey, there we go. Wasn't too hard. Oh, he has one more hit left. But yeah, it says Crow's Nest, but uh. He's not really a crow. Oh my god, I'm dead. <laughs> That's pretty funny, actually. Okay, so let's try to not screw this up. Like I was saying, this guy is not a crow. Diddy, Diddy, you need to stop ducking. That's, that's kind of bad. There we go. Ah, uh, drop your egg. Drop your egg. And run right into it. Kill by your own kin. How does that make you feel? Not very good, does it? Yeah, that's my thoughts. Okay, so don't be an idiot and stand in place like I did. You gotta run around here. Yeah, drop your eggs. Yeah, that's what I thought. Whoops, I accidentally, I accidentally threw that. I was holding the up button, dude. That's not fair. Oh, come on. I jumped on the egg, that was weird. Yeah, there we go. That wasn't too hard. No problem whatsoever. And of course, you get a token for defeating him. So that's always cool. So you always get a token in case you don't find any, uh... In case you don't find any, uh, bonus levels. So here we have the first the first level of the second world. We have about 10 more minutes, so let's go ahead. Try to see how far we can get. Oh yeah, I love this music too, man. Shut up, Brian. We all know that you like the music. You can just set up. Alright, alright, dude. Alright, we got it. 
Yeah, there we go. Have these little gremlins in the, uh, or kremlins in the barrels. They get pretty annoying, I say. Yeah, give me my DK, uh, give me my banana metal. Banana metal, banana token, who cares? Semantics, right? Kill the alligators, yes. Of course, we gotta use the lava alligators to run around. I mean, what type of alligator lives in lava anyway? Have you ever thought about that? Like, why are these alligators in lava? I am just bewildered by the thought. Like, I didn't think anything of it as a kid, but now I'm like, dude, how are there alligators here? What type of alligator species do you need to be to live in lava? To live in a volcano? I mean, it's so crazy. Whatever. <laughs> you don't think about these things, dude. You just accept it. And it drops you off nicely at the midpoint. And here we have a little new spider. You have a little new buddy spider. I think his name is Spitter. But I'm not sure. If you go up here, you get the DK uh, coin. Oh boy. I forgot the suit. <laughs> y button, dude. There we go. He makes platforms and you can suit stuff. Yeah, alright. There we go. Not too hard. Uh, don't get hit by the bee, dude. There we go. Jump! I think there's something up here. Hold on, hold on. There is something up here, ha ha! You cannot hide from Spider Guy. Totally not rip off a of Spider-Man, he is Spider Guy. And we get to use our little Spider Buddy for this. Go Spider Guy, go! And that was really easy. <laughs> no problem whatsoever. Ah! Freaking bodybuilders. Go back to the boy next door where you came from. <laughs> God, Flocker Dude! Can't believe you sold me those. But another bonus game? Really? Fine. I'll go there. I'm like, yeah, sir, I won't I won't find all the bonus games, and here I am here I am doing all of them. God. This one's a little bit more tricky because you gotta uh jump across lava, but you know, it's it's really not that bad. I mean not for a veteran like I am who plays this game so many times. And you gotta get rid of the spider here, but he gives you a nice little one up balloon before he leaves. Who knew the spiders had one up balloons inside them? I didn't. There we go. Play that beatbox, did he? Play it. Hmm. I love it. Took about four minutes to do. That's Clubus Kiosk. That's the place you go to for the secret worlds. There's Winky's Bonus Bonanza. Bonanza. Boy, that's a weird way of saying it. Ah, uh, win free free one ups. But I think I'm good. Oh yes. This is one of the songs I made up lyrics for. It was only for a certain part of the song. That was weird. It was really weird. It was like off that... Hold on. Yeah, there we go. You can't beat me. Um, I also used the remix song of this in uh, one of my Super Paper Mario Let's Plays. It was when I was speeding up the... Uh, I was speeding up the Pit of 100 Trials. Yeah, I kind of used the OC Remix version of this. Um, yeah, I think it worked out pretty well, because, uh... It was kind of like a little prelude to my LP of this. There we go. Get a little secret over here. If you're skilled enough to jump on the Firefly, Dragonfly, whatever. Yeah, there we go. Skills right here. Cause honestly, I was debating whether to, uh, whether to do this or the conduit. And I really like the conduits. It's one of my favorite game, one of my favorite first-person shooters for the Wii. But uh, 
I haven't really seen too many let's plays of it. I'm like, is there a reason for that? Is, did do not many people like it or has there been copyright strikes against it? I mean, I don't know. I mean, I already got told you the story about what happened with me and the uh, Red Steel 2. That was like one of my favorite games ever for the uh, Wii. But uh, it kind of got taken down by Ubisoft. Ubisoft, Ubisoft, who cares? I don't think they deserve their name pronounced right. They're going to do that to me. I mean, come on, dude. Why would you freaking uh, block me for promoting one of your games, saying how cool it is? And it's like, oh, nope. Take this game down. Copyrighted. God, come on. I got pretty mad when that happened. I'm like, dude. Alright, anyway, enough about that. But, uh, what I was saying before was that it was either this or the conduit. And I'm like, well, I didn't really want to go straight into the con straight into a Wii game. Or another Wii game, so I say. Because Super Paper Mario was obviously a Wii game. Um... So I was like, I should probably go in to do a game that I really enjoyed as a kid. You know, that's what a lot of LPers tend to do. They play games from their past and share it with people. And that's what I'm doing right now. It's playing a simple game, showing you all the memories I have from it. I mean, this was like really an awesome game as a kid. I mean, I didn't play a lot of games as a kid, but, uh,. This was one of them I played a lot, and I'm really glad that this was a really popular game. I don't know. I don't know how to describe it. Yes, there you go, Diddy. Run off. Run off. Oh, we got Lava Lagoon. I don't think we have much time for that. Uh, let's go ahead and do this real quick. We got the bonus music playing. Freaking swanky. Here he asks you trivia questions, and if you get them right, you get, uh, uh, you get one-ups, or lives, or whatever. Uh, what is the name of the first level level in this area? I don't know, Hothead Bob? Yeah, there we go. I don't remember this stuff. What is the name of the area of this island? Uh, Crocodile Cauldron? Alright, there we go. Uh, four, I think. Yeah, there you go. So you get them all right, then you get a, uh, you get a one up. If you do the higher games, then you get more lives. Simple as that. And here we have Funky's flights. Yeah, look at that. It's just floating in midair. Look at that. It defies gravity. <laughs> I don't know how he does that. Yeah, yeah, you can hire a plane to go to, the, to go to past worlds. Because for some reason, you can't go from world to world without Funky's flights. And that's kind of always, like, made me, like, wonder, like, why didn't you just go to the beginning and go back down to the next world? I don't know. I mean, I guess. I mean, you need some use for those banana tokens, right? Huh. <laughs> Alright, anyway, let's go to Clubless Kiosk real quick. No, or this land lovers, no. These Clubba, the cross me bridge, is gonna cost her many pieces of eight. Uh huh. They cost 15 crim, crim coins, whatever. Crim coins, tokens, whatever. Fight him! <laughs> yeah, there's no way to get past him. I love how they give you the option to fight him when you really can't. Alright, well, anyway, um. That about does it for this recording session. We're about 30 minutes right now. And I'll split the videos up and we'll see how that goes. So, uh, hopefully this works out. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.